We have beach ball time again. Everyone's getting all relaxed and they think, oh God, the beach ball again, oh my God. Right, so these guys are far too relaxed. We've not seen anyone over there yet. So the beach ball comes over to, oh, look at that. But yeah, don't worry, that's, oh, I shoved it. I love that, look, shoved it right. No, it's okay, you've passed it to him, that's it. No, no, not me, I ain't doing none of that rubbish. Uh, sir, would you mind coming up, please? Give him a big round of applause, thanks again. Bring the ball. And, uh, yep, we're gonna have somebody else over there. There you go, who's it gonna be? Is it, it looks like it's a lady. It's gonna be you. Yes, would you mind coming up, please? There you go, over this side, please. Thank you very much. And we're gonna have right over there, Who's it gonna be? Yes, you, you lovely lady. Up you come, give a big round of applause. And uh, I know this lady, it's Nikki. Oh, she's a powerful woman. Nikki, could you throw it over there, please? Go for it. <laughs> Who's it gone to? It's gone to somebody who dares to reach behind them. It's Caroline, up you come, Caroline. Give Caroline a round of applause. Guys, would you mind coming over here this time? A little bit of variety. We have so much fun with this ball, don't we? That's great. Excellent. So we have four people going to be uh, helping us a little, um, little adventure. Now, we've got four chairs, but don't worry about the chairs. We're going to find some homes for those in a minute. Would you mind moving forward, please? One of these is going to be our leader. We have three men, or oh, three ladies. <laughs> it's been a... It's been, a, it's been a long day. We've got three lovely ladies and we have one fine man. But you are the audience and you're going to judge who gets the top job. So what I'd like you to do is I'm going to uh, point to these people one at a time and if you think that they deserve the top billing, please give them a big cheer. So we have our lone man. Do you think he deserves it? Yeah. Not bad. What about this lady? Powerful woman. What do you think? Yeah. But small things come in lovely packages, don't they? What about this lovely lady? Yeah. And what about the feisty one? What do you think? Yeah. I don't know. I think actually the biggest roar probably came with you, my dear. <laughs> there you go. Would you mind coming over here? Give this young lady a round of applause. Excellent. And your name is? Carly. Carly. And what do you do, Carly? Do you mind me asking? I'm a support worker. Oh, yeah. OK. So you're used to bossing people about, are you? Oh, perfect. That's great. Great. So, Carly, over here, you're going um, to be making a, a choice of one of these. So, Carly, would you just mix them up, please? Don't look at them as yet. We will come to that in a moment. And I'd like you just to slide out one of them, anyone you want. Is that OK? And we're going to pop it inside here. Oops, if I can get it in, there you go. And I'm going to keep it here in full view. And that was very fair. So, Carly, would you mind just popping the rest of the cards just down there? Wonderful. But, Carly, there's some seats over here. And you're going to be selecting some of your minions to sit on the seats. OK? So, Carly, first of all, we have a red seat full of red cards. I'd like to select one of these people that you don't know these people, no. but just looking at them, you think one of them has got a really bad temper. It's going to be the, the, the feisty one. I'm, like, it's, I'm, not, I'm not picking this, otherwise I'm in a doghouse. Who, who do you think? Which, uh, do, you, do you think the gentleman or one of the two ladies? Who do you think? The lady the, in the middle. The lady in the middle. <laughs> you obviously know her quite well. Uh, yeah, would you mind sitting there, please? Thank you very much. And would you pick up the cards? And when you look at the cards, you'll see that they're all different. They've all got numbers on. Please take a seat. Thank you. And just give them a good mix-up. Now, we've got two left. We've got the yellow ones and the black one, OK? So uh, the black one, I'd like you to look at these two people and go for the, the black one is the one that's usually the, the most miserable. You know, <laughs> that sort of brightens up the room when they walk out of it. Do you know that sort of person, you know? So which one of these two people? <laughs> Neither of them. No, no, just go for it. Don't worry, they won't be upset. Man. The man! <laughs> OK. Take a seat there. Yeah, OK. And that means the yellow seat is for you. Lovely. Thank you ever so much. And would you, yeah, please take, take the final seat. And the reason I did that is because what's going to happen next is, is totally random. And if people sat in different chairs, the outcome would be clearly very, very different. So what I'd like you all to do, please, is I'd like you to mix up your cards, have a look at, look at them. They've all got three-digit numbers on. 
They're all different. And I'd like you just to take out one of them, any one you want. Is that okay? And I'll take the other cards away, if that's okay. Thank you very much. Excellent. Now we're going to have a little bit of audience participation. Has everyone got a phone with them? If you've got a phone, could you get the phones out and put it on the calculator, please? Because you're all going to be having a little go of this. And the reason I want you to do it is sometimes people think that if it's my calculator, maybe it's a dodgy calculator and stuff like that. But you can trust me. I'm a magician. So, we're going to get three numbers totally randomly picked by these lovely people. So, I'd like you to look at your card, please. And it's got three digits on it, correct? Yeah. I'd like you to call out one of them. Five. Five. Don't do anything yet, but that's going to be 500 and one of your numbers? Seven. 570. Nine. In your calculators, 579, please. Could you type <laughs> that one in? And then press plus because we're going to do a sum. And that was a totally random number. Would you like to pick one of the other numbers, please? Five. Another five. Five? You've got two fives, have you? Yeah. Oh, okay. Five. <laughs> Three. Three. 532, and then press plus again, and this will be the easy one, it will be the number that's left, and what's the last number? Seven. Se oh, seven. Eight. Seven, eight. Seven. seven, eight, seven. And obviously, if they'd pick different numbers, <coughs> they would be totally different. And now press equals, and hopefully, if everyone's done it the same, you might get the same <laughs> number. Do you mind me asking, what is the number? What is it? One eight one. So I'll just write that one up. What was it? One one eight nine eight. Totally random. I think you'd all agree. This is the funny thing. Would you mind popping over here? These are the cards that you just mixed up. If I turn them over, each of the cards have got a picture on, but a date. So, for example, the iPhone, 2007. That was when the iPhone was invented. Weird, isn't it? 1912 was when the Titanic sadly sunk. 1776, that was uh, Independence Day. We've got penicillin. Oh, that's a good one. The toilet roll was invented in 1857. <laughs> there you go. And we've got Harry Potter. We've got all these different ones. They've all got dates on them. And you took one card out, over here, right at the beginning, before these guys did absolutely anything. And it's quite curious because it's Ferrari, Enzo Ferrari, his birthday. And would you mind reading out what the birthday is? 1898. 1898. Isn't that coincidence? But there's more. Would you mind just going behind your chair? And guys, I'll take these cards off of you. Totally random. And I'd like you all to stand up, please, and just move behind your chairs. 1898, what a special year. I'd like you all to turn around your chairs, please, because on the back of your chairs, would you mind turning them around? You have 1898. Would you give our helpers a big round of applause? Take a seat. 